so where if you know, you know, and if you don't, we confirm it. Kama tayari uko na dictionary, thumbs up. Kama uko na encyclopedia, thumbs up. Jipigia makofi. Because wewe ni mtu uko ready kujibu maswali, zenye watashindu wa kujibu. Just in case. I'll see you. As per K. Mimi ni anka wako wapo. Anita Buda Boss. Hapa mazari tunataka leo kujua kutakuwaje ni kona all ladies in the house. Wata nianze na... Wata nianze na inside. Wata nianze na inside. Do a contest. I'm sorry, unikina nani. Madam, what is your name? What do you do? Um, I'm Emma. Yes. And I'm a student. Student? Wapi? I'm um, Jake Watt. Hey! Alma mata angu, napenda yu. Unasome nini? <laughs> um, my city management. City management. Wow. Karibu sana Emma. Unasema Emma ya? Yeah? yeah. Emma. Karibu sana Emma. Madam, what's your name and what do you do? Susan. Yes. Susan Minor. Susan Minor. A podcaster and a student at Zitek University. Podcaster and student at Zitek. Yes. Napenda yu. Podcaster yu kwa netu wajis. Kwa nye nizangukia nisikize kidogo. Yeah. Re- just my name is Susan Minor Show. Susan Minor Show. Yeah, unaze pato on iHeartRadio. Uh-huh. Uh, uh, ni iko on iTunes, yes. iko on Google Podcast, yes. iko on uh, Spreaker. Yes. Yes. Safi. Take the foot. Let's put skis up here to pick a thumbs up. Papo. <laughs> muhimu, muhimu. It team in it was Emma and Susan. The, the bosses. bosses. Hey! The bosses! But I'm course. sorry. Right. <laughs> <laughs> what is your name and what do you do? Uh, my name is Elizabeth yes. Ndungu. Yes. I'm an advocate of the High Court. Advo- <laughs> <laughs> Leo mwa tunetea watu wa up initio au bita bita whatever that is no same way Karibu sana Elizabeth karibu sana madam what's your name and what you do Ah uh, my name is Njanju Yes I'm a life enthusiast Enthusiast Eh yaro Njanju na sauti mchanje Life enthusiast all right Njanju Elizabeth it is minute waje Ama Ama. Yeah. Ama, ama, ama. Ama. Ama with an R. With an R. R yeah. and a O. Okay. Ama. <laughs> our bosses team, the bosses. We are going to begin with our quick fire trivia. We are going to ask them 10 questions. They have 60 seconds to respond. Every correct answer is going to earn them 100 points. In case they don't know the answer, they shall wonderfully say Pass. Napenda hiyo. Pass. Okay. All right, Elizabeth, if you're ready, your time officially begins now. Between anode and cathode, which one is the positive electron? Anode. Correct. How many dots are used in each letter in the brain system? Time is ticking. Three. Three. In. Correct. What are birds of a feather say to do? Uh, stick together. Stick together. In. Correct. What instrument can be bass, electric, or Spanish? Guitar. Correct. What do the numbers add up to on the opposite sides of a dice? 20. 20. In. Correct. In the zodiac, which animal is linked with Capricorn? Oh. Oh, time is ticking. Serpent. Serpent. In. Correct. What is the 13th letter of the English alphabet? M. Correct. Where is a horse? Uh, where in a horse is the coffin joint? <laughs> <laughs> In which century was 1658? 16th century? In, correct. Which traffic light follows green? Red. Red. In. Yellow. Correct. I follow RJ. Kiza. Ile siku tuona traffic light imetoka green ikaenda red. Wachana nayo. Wachana na. Yellow. 1658 is the 17th century. It's fine, it's fine. <laughs> oh, the animal linked with Capricorn is goat. And then the numbers that add up on the opposite side of a dice is seven. They add up to seven. And then birds of a feather don't stick together. What do they do? They flock. Flock. Flock together. Together. You're almost there. The braille system has six letters. And of course, you got the first one correct. You have one, two, three questions correct. 300 points to me as an ayo au ni the ama bosses mnaweza kama mnaona kama hii mnapita hiyo tatu haraka fast ama tu 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 kwa nasiwasi ai wasiwasi ya nini ya nini mimi na kile uzito sasa tanianze na wewe watu waona wasiwasi question number one if you ready your time begins now 
Which swimming stroke is named after an insect? Butterfly. Correct. What unit is used to measure length of horses standardized to four inches? Inches. Yes, time is speaking. What's your answer? Meters. Meters in. Correct. <laughs> <laughs> Bed cells are found in which part of the body? Bed cells are found in which part of the body? Pass. Yeah, right. Which type of calendar is used today in the Western world? Type of calendar? Pass. Pass. All right. Which city is said to have been founded by Romulus and Remus? Greek. Greek. In. Correct. Which animal's name comes first in the dictionary? Ant. Ant. In. <laughs> Correct. What is the plural of the word sheep? <laughs> Ships. <laughs> Ships. <laughs> Ships. In. Correct. <laughs> A young domestic chicken, turkey, or other fowl that is being raised for food is called a... A chicken. A chicken. The <laughs> 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 Oh, Jesus. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Hey, let's say that one together. Oh, Jesus. All right. A young domestic chicken, turkey, or other fowl... <laughs> She's called a chicken. <laughs> the correct answer is a poult. It's a poult. <laughs> the plural for sheep is sheep. Apo kwa sheep, whatever. All right. The city that was founded by Romulus and Remus is Rome. Rome. The calendar that we use in the Western world is Gregorian calendar. And bed cells are found in the brain. And of course, the unit that is used to measure length of horses standardized to four inches, it is the hand. Now we know. You guys have a good start. I like it. <laughs> 100 points. <laughs> <laughs> the horses are at 100 points. The armor. You have an opportunity of choosing between history, sports, food, and drink. Janju, Elizabeth, which one? Okay, Elizabeth, chagua kitu life enthusiast atapambana nae. <laughs> uh, food and drink. Food and drink, wisdom. Okay, are you ready? No. You're not? Yes. Too bad. We're gonna go anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Your time officially begins now. Which country originated the term plonk for wine? Spain. Spain, in, correct. An affogato is an Italian desert of coffee and what ingredient? Um, pass. Pass, all right. Which famous soft drink brand was invented in the United States on 29th January 1892? Going with Coca Cola. Coca Cola, correct. If you ordered Sancho in a Japanese restaurant, what would you get served? Pass. Pass, all right. Which company has a slogan, Your Guarantee of Quality? Tell me, sticking. It's for food and drink. Yeah, but, yeah, pass, believe pass, it or not. Pass, pass. all right. <laughs> Black forest cake originates from which country? Pass. Pass, all right. Coffee plants originated on what continent over 1,000 years ago? Uh, Time is ticking. South of America. South of America, in, correct. What is the spiciest chili in the world? Uh, pepper. Of course, pepper is <laughs> a chili, but which one? <laughs> Black pepper. Black pepper, in, correct. How many segments are inside most oranges? Twelve. Twelve. In. Correct. A food cost meal that concludes a meal and usually consists of sweet food. It's called? Uh, a six course meal. Six course meal. In. Correct. Uh, dessert. Dessert. Oh. <laughs> Me had a whole meal. Oh. <laughs> How many segments are inside most oranges? It is ten, not twelve. Yeah. The spiciest chili is called the Carolina Reaper. Black forest cake originates from Germany. Mm -hmm. All right, you are guarantee of quality. That's the slogan for farmer's choice. <clears throat> and of course, Sancho means Japanese pepper. Sancho is Japanese pepper. And of course, plonk for wine, that is Australia. And affogato is an Italian dessert of coffee and ice cream. Okay, you have an additional 100 points if I'm not wrong. 400 points. 
for the armor. Watu wangu mmebaki na history na <laughs> na sports. Let's <laughs> <laughs> bring it on brother. <laughs> bring it on. Na pata ya confidence. Emma, tunakufa na gani? Tunakufa na gani? History. History, you know wisdom. You know wisdom. All right. <laughs> Emma, naanza na wewe if you're ready, so am I. You're good. First question. Napoleon was a statesman and military leader of which country? Pass. Pass. All right. On which day of the week are British elections held? Which day of the week? Yes. Sunday. Incorrect. How many kings of England have been called Philip? Time is ticking. Eight. Eight. Incorrect. What was invented by Lewis Waterman in the 1880s? Pass. All right. For over 30 years, which tobacco company gave its name to a football yearbook? What? Time is ticking. I pass. All right, which is the first month of the year to have exactly 30 days? Feb March. M March in. No. Correct. <laughs> which new weapon was introduced in battle in 1916? I pass. All right. The German attack on which country caused Britain to enter the Second World War? <laughs> Does Uganda have a multi-party system of governance? Yes or no? Yes. Correct. Which is the most popular visited city in Africa? In Africa? Yes. My Jesus. Pass. Pass. <laughs> Johannesburg. I... Johannesburg. Where? Poleni. Poleni. This is the I know. I know. I know. I know. Germany attack on Poland led to the Second World War. And of course, the 1916 invention of war was the tank. Kisha, the first month of the year that has 30 days is April. The month of April. Rothmans is the tobacco company I was looking for. And of course, Lewis Waterman invented fountain pen. <laughs> oh, how many kings of England have been called Philip? None. Zero. No. <laughs> and elections in British, or in Britain rather, are held on Thursdays, not Sunday. And uh, Napoleon was a statesman and military leader of France. Good job. Another one, two hundred, I think. Oh, Polini. Another one hundred points. 200 points for the bosses. Mukosa, Mukosa, Mukosa. The vote here now is only 200 points. Anything can happen on this show. We move on to our next challenge, which is two truths and My one lie. Hey, Napenda. What a mungu. This is the quiz show. We are on to our next challenge, which is two truths and one lie. The task at hand is to figure out which of the three statements I shall read out is the false statement. Here you're free to discuss and give me the team answer, but we have no opportunity of snatching any points. So since you're leading, my team leaders, you go first. I hope you can be able to make this one 500 points. Your three statements, which I believe shall also appear on the screen, read as follows. The iguana is the largest lizard in the world. True or false? The tuba is the largest brass instrument in an orchestra. True or false? Then sunk is Italian for five. Or Italians call it cinque in their pronunciation. One, two, three. Which one is false? Janju. Yes. Which one? <coughs> one. One is false. The iguana is the largest lizard in the world. That one, yes. You're one. sure? You know. You're not sure? I'm not sure, but. But? Go I'm that. going with one. You're going with one? Yes. I am, you know, hopeful. Hopeful? Yes. Mm, yes. Call it! It's not the largest lizard in the world. That is a false statement. All right, you have an opportunity of making this one 300 points. I believe you can do so. Your statements read as follows. The Latin phrase ante meridium means after midday. 
true or false? Statement number two. There are 86,400 seconds in a day. 86,400 seconds in a day. True or false? Statement number three. A zoos is the offspring of a male zebra and a female horse. A zoos is the offspring of a male zebra or if you like zebra and a female horse. One, two, or three. Which one is false? Susan Emma. Which one is false? Emma Nipajibu. Jiamini. Hmm? Time is ticking. All right, your time is up. Give me an answer or I give. Yes. The third one. The third one is false. Azos. Masaba nyeye kusomo kweli. Zibra na farasi zinatoa na wapi? Si ni kweli? Hapana, they have an spring I to Azos. Hata kama siko na host ngezi to Azos. Yeah, by the way ni kweli. Inezaitwa? Mule. Mule. I think. Mule. Ah. Ah, okay. Okay. All right. Let me tell you for free. There are 86,400 seconds. It is true. In a day. Good job. Let me also tell you for free. That the Latin phrase ante meridian means after midday. It is false. It is before midday. Oh boy. And believe it or not, Zos. Don't you? Hata mimi niligundua nikasema. Wewe mtu aligundua alikuwa anafanya nini? Anyway. So far 500 points for the Ama and 200 points for Team The Bosses. Let's find out when you kutaku after this short commercial break. Shikili hapo. Welcome back to the quiz show where if you know, you know, and if you don't, we confirm it. Remember, if you want to send us an SMS, our line is triple one, triple four, triple one. But then you're curious. Muna sumama na team gani? Kamo ye ni team Njanju na team Elizabeth. Yo ni the ama. Tweet mti yangu. Kamo ye ni team. The bosses. Unaamini they can make a comeback. Fanya yo kitu kwa mtandao very fast. Now we come to our next challenge which is guess the meaning of the word. Hapa tusisumbuani na vitu mingi. All we are looking for is the correct synonym. Here too. Hapa sasa we can discuss but we can also snatch points. Mukilara muna pitwa live live. Leaders, you go first. Your first word is penchant penchant options are a proclivity b strength c invulnerability d perfection is it a b c or d elizabeth okay njanju amekataa njanju which one yes njanju yeah okay a a proclivity Elizabeth, you had a better choice. Just say it. No, no, I'll go with A. Which one was your initial choice? <coughs> My initial choice yes. was C, but we're going with A. It was C, but you're going with A. Yes. All right. Let me tell you for free. C is incorrect. A, correct. 100 points. Hey, hey. <coughs> 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 All right, can you guys make this for 300 Bye. points? I believe you can. Your word is quandary. Quandary. Options are A, facility, B, dilemma, C, disencumbrance, and D, resolution. Is it A, B, C, or D? Emma, can I hear from you? A, B, C, or D? Um, dilemma. Dilemma, would you like to change your answer? No. Susan, last chance? No. No? All right. Me too. I will not change my answer because dilemma. <laughs> <laughs> it's correct. I like it. 300 points. Can you guys extend your lead to 700 points? Your word is recalcitrant. Options are A, 
amenable, B, docile, C, compliant, D, willful. Is it A, B, C, or D, recalcitrant? Janju, you seem to have an answer. A, B, C, or D? <clears throat> Time is ticking. B. B. Docile. Recalcitrant, docile. You want to change your answer? Do it. Last chance. One, two, three. A. Oh. Amenable. Amenable. Yes, yes. All right. Kufen amenable. I like it. Incorrect. You guys have an opportunity of scratching 100 points. Will you? Susan. C. 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 Compliant. All right. Mimi naenda na incorrect. The correct answer is D. Willful. <laughs> All right. Over to you. The next one is winsome. Winsome. Your words are appalling. Be proud. C is heinous. D endearing. Appalling. Proud. Heinous. Or endearing. Rudia Tena. Sawa. Winsome. Options are A. Appalling. B. Proud. C. Heinous. D. Endearing. Endearing. A, B, C, or D. Mm. Susan. Let's go with D. Let's go with D. Endearing. Yeah. Would you want to change your answer? Ah, kufa nao. Kufa nao. All right, to sote. The answer is correct. A hundred points. <laughs> Four hundred points. From the bosses. Moving on swiftly to our next challenge, which is spell the word. <laughs> This is the quiz show. We are on to our challenge of spell the word. We read out a statement, pick out a word, ask them to spell it for us. Easy peasy, come on, if you ask me. Our leaders, Munenda first, come okay. And of course, we can discuss that to Kihata. We have an opportunity of snatching 100 points. Are you ready? Yes. Nangoda sana kuskia nchanjua kinkia spelling up. The film's denouement was unsatisfying and ambiguous. Spell for me denouement. 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 Aya, Elizabeth, we're going to take me up on the meona. Denouement. Denouement. Are you ready? Yes. Beautiful. Let's do it. Sure, I think. I do. I do. I do. Aya. Let's go. D E. D E. N. N. U U M M O O U U R R E E Denouement Mo Do you want to change anything? No, it's Denouement Denouement Yes Denouement Yes Okay, uh, let me try again Let's go D D E. E. N. N. U. U. M. M. O. O. Yes. All right. O. Incorrect. Suga and Emma. You have an opportunity of making this one 500 points. Um, Let's go, Emma. D. D. E. E. N. N. U. U. M. M. O. O. Ari, <laughs> Ari, <laughs> Ari, <laughs> Ari, Correct spelling is D E N O U E M E N T. Denumo. Ari, 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 Susan, what are you scared to go on behalf of the team? Hemorrhage. 
a massive hemorrhage of the brain. Okay, Susan, yes. Where? Uh, yeah, 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 no, H E R M O U R H E R M O U R A G E A G E <laughs> Come on, Baya! Baya! <laughs> <Nimbaya. Incorrect. laughs> Elizabeth, spell it for me! Aya, H H A A E E M M O O R R R R A A G G E Double R or uh, R or single R? Double R. For sure? Yes. Last chance? Yes. Okay. Double R is correct. Though the spelling is incorrect. <laughs> correct spelling is H E M O double R H A G E. No point. That's hemorrhage. Over to you. Can you make this one 700 points? Your statement reads as follows. She is a Tamagant wife. <laughs> Spell for me Tamagant. Janju. Tamagant wife. <laughs> Ready when you are. Oh, uh, okay. Yes. Kupa tunayo. Kama mbaya. Mbaya. Are you ready? T. T. Mm -hmm. T. T. E. T. E. May I start again? Please. Okay. T. E. R. T. E. R. M. M. E. E. G. A. N. T. G. A. N. T. Would you? I'm sure you don't want to change your answer. Am I right? I have no other answer. No other answer. Yeah. Incorrect. Emma, you can snatch 100 points. Um, T E. T E. Let me start. Please. T E R. T E R. M A R. M A R. G A N T. G A N T. Would you like Emma to change your answer? Anywhere, remove or add any letter. Um, uh, T E R T E R M A M A G A N T G A N T. Umetoa nini? R. Unakufa nayo? Acha nkufe nayo. Susan, is that wisdom? Tutoe tu bakishe. Last chance? Tukufe pamoja. Tukufe pamoja. Mina tuende yo confidence muka nayo. One more time. I like it. In. The correct zone. Correct. You're in the correct zone. Correct answer. Correct. 100 points. Oh. <laughs> hey, <laughs> 500 points. Can you make this 600 points a piece over to you? Your statement is as follows. The enforced camaraderie what? of office life. Spell for me camaraderie. Camaraderie. Suzanne. Please. <laughs> Aha! Alright, come on, Demi. Susan, you're not going to go Let's go! You're E. E. C. C. E. E. M. M. E. E. R. R. E. E. D. D. E. E. R. R. Double E. Double E. Unajua kizungu na kiswahili ni kitumbili to. Mukashua. Unajua hizi. Hizi kiswahili ni kitumbili. Lakini kibu mainsis. Kibu mainsis. Atulaki kwa hivyo. Elizabeth. Mm -hmm. Please, 
some English. Please spell it in English. Camaraderie. Is it possible for you to repeat this sentence? Yes, I can. I can. The enforced camaraderie of office life. Spell for me camaraderie. Remember, in English. Camaraderie. Okay. Ah, it's just trying. Mm. Um, yep. C O C O M A M A. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. All right. Um, allow me to start again. Please do. C O C O double M double M A A R R A A D D E E R R I I E. What do you think? Equal to incorrect. Yeah. Equal to equal. Let me tell you. D E R I E. Bakapo, correct. <laughs> Let me also tell you, C O double M and whatever else you say, incorrect. <laughs> correct spelling is C A M A R A. Wow, what a show we are having so far. I love this show. I love the energy. I love the contestants. Even the bomb of the 100 points apart from the two teams. Let's find out when you could acquire in the next challenge of Guess the Logo. <laughs> This is the quiz show. We are on to our challenge of Guess the Logo. The task at hand is simply brand identification. We're going to show them an image. All they have to do is tell us the brand name we are looking for. You can discuss and yes, you can snatch 100 points. Still, our leaders at 600 points is Team Alma. You go first and your image is this one. Elizabeth Njanju, what am I looking for? Gertrude's. Gertrude's? You're sure about it? Yes. What's your answer? I don't know. Gertrude's, is it? Is that the correct answer? Let's find out. Yes, yes it is. Yes. 100 yes. points. Yes. <laughs> I think you okay. 700 <laughs> points. All right. In the same street, tell me which one I am looking for in this image. <laughs> Where? Yes, Janju Elizabeth. Elizabeth. I am sure this is something you have seen somewhere. Hey. I am sure about it. Mm -hmm. Wow. Um I'll just guess. Please do. Oh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Let's go. Okay, uh that is what? Yep. We've seen it. Yes, I'm sure. <laughs> oh, okay. <clears throat> Go on, Janju. Believe in yourself. Okay. Yes. <laughs> say it. Just say it. Insurance. Say it. Insurance. Yeah, insurance. Say it. Whatever it is. Say it. You okay. never know. I <laughs> pass. Pass. No, no, no. Wait, wait, wait. wait. Oh. All right. AOL. AOL. All right. AOL. Hold that thought. Emma. Susan. Coptic. Coptic. Is it Coptic or is it AOL? Let's find out. Good <laughs> 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 I told you, Marona. I told you. I told you. I told you. I told you. Okay. <laughs> You have oh, yeah, the opportunity yeah. of making this one <laughs> 600 points. Susan Emma, your image is this one. You've also seen this one. Believe you me. What? You have seen this one. Okay. Emma, Susan. Hmm? Gani. Hi, Buddha boss. Eh? <laughs> Susan, who for the gun? I'm sorry. Don't let to get to abbreviation like KHA. Where am I? KHA. You say me KHA. Okay, KHA. Whatever that is. Whatever that is. Elizabeth in Janju. 
<coughs> Wamesema KHA. And I'm sure you've seen this. Where? <laughs> In Kenya. In Kenya. Mumeona Kenya. There's a zoom. There's a zoom. Yo nguguri. Ni kweli kwa barabara. Kwa barabara. Mm. Mm. Ah. <coughs> Nakufa now. Okay, 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 Hospital Association, I agree. I agree. Hospital Association, that's right now. In the way, I'm in the way, I come. Me and me to the hospital. Yeah, KHA. Yeah, yeah. Final image is this one. Just look at the colors, they tell you something. They tell you something. The shape tells you something. Once again, you've seen it. Emma, home ni wapi? Home, I don't miss our home quit. Any back at home with a pass anyway. You've seen this one. Last chance, Susan. Life boy. We go with it? Let's go with life boy. Let's go with life boy. I like it. Njanchu, Elizabeth. C20. Yes. Na red cross. Na red? Red cross. Ekwangi color red. Red cross. Any abstract art. Yes, so a red cross. Red cross, yeah, abstract art. What? I can't tell you. What is the Life boy. Which is which? Let's find out. Alright. We are coming next to our challenge, which is guess the price immediately after this shot. Commercial break. <laughs> All right, welcome back to the quiz show where we discover Ruai Family Hospital. <laughs> if you know, you know. If you don't, we confirm it. Next on to our challenge, which is guess the price the task at hand is simply to give us a price that falls within the price range we have of the product we have sampled from the leading supermarkets in the capital city of nairobi once again we can discuss and yes we can snatch a hundred points leading at is it still 600 700 700 points all right you have an opportunity of making this on 800 points your product is dental wet wipes 40 sheets. Dettol wet wipes. Wet wipes. Dettol. Mm -hmm. What is the price? Elizabeth? Give me a price. Elizabeth? Mm. Your time is ticking. Five. Okay, between? Yes. Not between. Give me your price. Wow. The range is mine. 60 or 80. Average. All right. Okay, 70. 70. 70, 70. 70 shillings? Yes. 40 sheets? 
40 sheets ni. Yes. Yeah. What what? Yes. 70 bob. Okay, wait. At Joey. Uh, How much you ring? 60. 60. 60. Yes, 60. 60 bob. Yes. Okay. Sawa. What is your price? Susan Emma. Jamini, kufa nae. Ini kuparalyze. Sawa. 65. Eh? 60. Mungu na haibo. Mungu na haibo biyabo. Correct price range is anything between 600 and 640. Nila kumbwa. Ah. Kwa ni. Nga ka picha kumbwa. Eh. Inaka. Mungu na kwa ni. Mungu na kwa ni. Kwa ni 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 Hurricane WC cleaner super power 500 ml hii mnajua eh ya hii ni mboga wewe Elizabeth nipe bei haraka haraka yeye dosifikirie just say it it's how many ml eh 500 500 ml uh i'll say 300 300 yes would you like to change your answer what do you think jaju would you like to change your answer Mm -hmm. So, in Kenya, maybe two fifty. Aya, final chance. Nipe bay. Aya, um, two fifty or three hundred. Two seventy. Two seventy. Two seventy. Namla kufanayo. All right. Emma, na Susan. Munatoa five papa munaongeza juu mwanayini yapo mali munatoa five papa. Emma, muna sawa zisha. Um, two fifty. Would you like to change your answer for whatever reason? Mm. 250. I just kufena hiyo. Mimi nayo. Yeah. Kufena nayo. The current price range is anything between 200 and 210 Kenya shillings. No point. Okay. <laughs> Over to you guys. Your next product is this one. KCC UHT Milk Value Pack. One liter, four pieces. Four pieces done. Up on the empty One liter. One liter. One liter. UHT. One twenty. One twenty. Susan. I don't Right. Give me your answer. Four fifty. Four fifty. I beg you, please change your answer. <laughs> By the masses of God. <laughs> But you don't have to. You don't have to. You beg me beg. Please. One liter. Wait. Last chance. Three. For it. For it. Umongeza thati bob. Una kufa nayo. Haya. Janju, Elizabeth. Sorry that one. All right. Yes. 350. Huh? 350. Kwani kwani mmetoa moja? It's a value pack. Oh, ni value pack kuna discount. Eh, so maybe 380ish. Ah, it yeah, yeah. We think. Karan kwa nimesawa hiyo part. All right. Correct price range is anything between 470 Kenya shillings and 500 Kenya shillings. Correct. 200 points. Okay. <laughs> Over to you. Opportunity to make this one 700 points a piece. Your product is Melvin's Masala Chai Tea Leaves 100 grams. Melvin's Masala Chai Tea Leaves 100 grams. 100 grams. Melvin's masala chai tea leaves 100 grams. Okay, Emma nipe bei. Nipe bei. Leo, just in case mnashangana. Yeah. Bei. Um. Amua. 90. 90 bob. Um include masala mu umetoa. That is included. 90 bob. Would like to change your answer? No. Susan. Tunaenda tunakufa pamoja. Jaju Elizabeth. Mimi <coughs> 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 Um 
um, 70, 80, 70. Hakuna cha 80, 70, amua. Kama ni 80, ni 80. Amua. 80, Bob. 80, Bob. Elizabeth, 80, Bob. Yeah. Would you like to change her answer? No, she shops for Melvin. Oh my God, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I apologize. Okay, I can't 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 be. Anything between 60 and 70. Oh, we got it. Correct. Six hundred points. No, no, six hundred. Yes, four. My team, the bosses, <laughs> and seven hundred points oh, my own guess. for the leader so far, the armor. <laughs> Final challenge of the game. Back to school. To school. Yeah. Yeah. Beef on a beach. Yeah. Yeah. This is the quiz show. We are on to my favorite challenge of back to school. We have four subjects we are going to ask them. Kiswahili, we have mathematics, we have science, we have ICT. Compulsory subject is Kiswahili. This is quick fire trivia you cannot discuss. Kila mtu anapambana na hali yake. Elizabeth ningependa nianze nao eh. Maana nyinyi ndio muongoza. Uko tayari? Ndio. Swali lako la kwanza ni hili. Sehemu ya kuwapokelea wagonjwa hospitalini huitwa Peter. Hai. Siku ambayo tuko sasa hivi inaitwa Mdako Roma leo. Leo umepata. Kitambaa kigumu sana cha kufungia sehemu iliyovunjika huitwa Peter. Peter. Ha. Mtoto wa mamba aitwaje? <laughs> Mwana mamba. Mwana mamba. <laughs> hey. Mungu tusaidie. Haya. Mwana mamba. <laughs> Umenoa. Kifaa cha kupengezea dawa mwilini huitwa sindano. Umepata? Kisawe cha barua ni Pita. Pita. Asante mwana mamba. Mwana mamba. Mwana mamba. Haya, kisawe cha barua ni waraka. Kisha mtoto wa mamba sio mwana mamba ni kigwena. Kigwena. Kisha kitambaa kigumu sana cha kufungia sehemu iliyovunjika huitwa plaster. Sehemu ya kuwapokelea wagonjwa hospitalini huitwa pambajio. Mmepata maswali mawili sahihi mko na alama 200 zaidi. Ah zaidi. Hey, hey. Ndio. Alama 900 kama sijakosea. Naam. Haya, mko na nafasi ya kuwa piku mkijikakamua. Ema, ni sawa nikieza nawe? Ni sawa. Haya, swali lako la kwanza basi ni hili. Kisawe cha msichana. Kama ujui. Uh, Peter. Haya. Kanusha. Runinga ingeanguka ingeharibika. Hmm? Runinga. Mhm. Mm Wait. Rudia to please. Haya. Runinga ingeanguka ingeharibika. Ingeharibika. Kukanusha. Ndiyo. Kanusha. Runinga. Hainge anguka, mm. hainge mjika. <laughs> Umenua. <laughs> Kitambacha kufungia jeraha au kidonda. Huitwa? Muda wa yoma yama? Bandeji. 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 Shikili hapo nda kuambia kama nitakupa ula. Kigari au kitanda cha kubebea wagonjwa. Huitwa? Kai wilche. Eh. Muda wa yoma? Pass. Pass. Haya. Chumba cha kujifungulia wajawazito. Huitwa? We. Mm, najua na kizungu. Unajua na kizungu? <laughs> Kwa hivyo? Pass. Peter. Haya. Mtoto wa mjomba wako utamuitaje? Binamu. Binamu. Banati. Umepata binamu. 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 Umepata. <laughs> Chumba cha kujifungulia wajawazito huitwa kungawi kisha kigari cha kitanda au kubebea kigari au kitanda cha kubebea wagonjwa huitwa machela kitambaa cha kufungia jeraha au kidonda ni bendeji najua unisema bandeji siji ni wewe nitakupa hey. nitakupa alama mia moja hapo kisha runinga isingeanguka isingeharibika hiyo hainge ni ya mta kisawe cha msichana ni banati Hivi sasa mmepata maswali mawili sahihi alama 200 zaidi mko na alama 800. Leaders 900 ni hawa. All right. 
Leaders, have 900 points. Mathematics, science, or ICT. Done. Janju, give me your answer. Time is up. Matt. Matt, all right. Ready when you are. First question. How many edges are in a cube? Time is ticking. Time is ticking. Sixteen. Sixteen. Incorrect. How many minutes are in five hours? Three hundred. Correct. A fraction whose denominator is a power of ten is called a decimal. Correct. What is the number of the sides of a pentadecagon? Seven. Incorrect. What is the first prime number? Two. Correct. The cube root of the number of 64 is what? Four. Oh, no, 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 no. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> um, pass. Pass. All right. The answer is four. Four. Okay, wait. Ah. Pentadecagon has 15 sides. And of course, an air cube has 12 edges. You tried Mopotangapi. One, two, three. Questions correct. 300 additional points. Mufana Bizuri, 1,200 points. What wrong? If you choose well, you can be able to snatch this one. Science, ICT, gun. Give me your answer. Science. 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 Susan, now if you're ready. Which is the largest land carnival in Britain? Large carnival. Yes, in Britain. Lion. Lion. In correct. Which substance is the most used for pencil lead? Um, zinc. Zinc. In correct. Bright's disease affects which organs of the body? Sorry. Bright's disease affects which organs of the body? The body. Yes. Wow. Pass. Pass. All right. How many stomachs does a cow have? Um, four. Correct. What gives red blood cells their color? The color. Yes. No pass. Time. Pass. Pass. What is the body of a penguin covered with? Um. What? Time is ticking. Uh, Time is up. Oh my gosh. <laughs> what? Feathers is the correct answer. Sama sama. Red blood cells, or time in the red blood cells get their color from the hemoglobin. And of course, Bryce disease affects the kidneys. What we find in pencil is graphite. And of course, the badger is the largest land carnival in Britain. All right, half a summer. You guys have got it one. Question, additionally correct. You have finished strong at 900 points, but one will remember. To participate on this show, all you have to do is send us an SMS to the number triple one triple four triple one. Let's keep this conversation going online at Freddy Budabos. Winners, Asante Sana. Please join me as we ask Mutuangu alive. Kufanya, fanya unai.